Hey everyone, I'm here to talk about Vive XR Elite and the enhancements coming in our Photo 4 update. The new software update includes enhanced hand tracking, parental controls, easier app downloads, and much more. Let's dive in. First, let's talk about hand tracking. With the latest update, you'll see the hand tracking engine is now more reliable in a wider range of lighting conditions. That means you'll experience better performance overall, particularly in low light conditions. You also see improvements in high brightness conditions, as well as environments with reflective surfaces. Next up, relocation. We originally set the tracking software to be quite cautious in recognizing its surroundings, but this led to some of you having to do room setup too often. So now with Photo 4, if the headset cannot relocate itself, instead of this triggering the room setup immediately, your Vive XR Elite will first ask you to keep looking around to try to relocate itself before asking you manually create a new room setup. Additionally, we're adding what we call instant mode. This is great for people who want to use their headset in different spaces and want to just put on the headset and immediately start using it. Instant mode bypasses the environment setup, putting you in the center of a three meter diameter circular boundary, perfect for when you're at home or in the office and you want to quickly just dive into VR without doing any environment setup. You can turn on instant mode in the tracking settings, but please note, this mode never creates a map, so it's best suited for VR as mixed reality experiences tend to require more setup of walls and desks, etc. We've also added some UI changes to enhance your experience. Now it's even easier to navigate through different features and submenus. Plus, we've made improvements to our store interface in our previous update, making it a breeze to explore and access your favorite apps in the library. And for peace of mind, we've also introduced parental controls. This makes it easy to limit the time in headset, choose the content available, and even see what the user is seeing. All of this can be set up in the Vibe Manager companion app on iOS or Android with a pin to protect it. The update will be rolling out globally from June 7th onwards, and you'll receive a notification in the UI when it's available. You can also manually check for it in the settings. Vive streaming has also been updated. It's now quicker and easier to stream thousands of existing PC VR content titles to your Vive XR Elite over USB-C or Wi-Fi, including Wi-Fi 6E where available. Check the link in the description for a full guide on that. Stay tuned for more updates to come, and thanks for watching. See you in the next one.